And yes, I am recording this. All right, so this hand looks pretty sweet. Good enough, I think. He decides to play first. All right, I do not mind. Hopefully, I should be able to wrap past whatever he intends to do. Yes. Verdant Catacombs. Ooh. What can I do with that? Nothing yet. So, I'm going to go ahead and play the birds, hold on to that crypt until I can do something. Could play a Rafik of the Mini, that's about it. Or a Genesis. That might not be a bad play. Alright, so one, two, three, four, five. Uh yeah, that seems fine. Alright, so let's do it. Four four on turn three is pretty good. Turn two actually. Alright, so he attacks for three. I'm okay with that. And where's he playing? Alright, so we're gonna get him for a lot of damage here. Probably. Alright, so heads. I lost. Bummer. Alright, so. that down. Tap for the Rafik. Tap with Genesis for 10. Alright. He's going to need something pretty sweet here. We'll take a look, see what he's got. Perilous mirror. All right. Let's say yes. I won that time, cool. Hmm. What could I do? I could hit him for seven. I could exile Mir, attack with the treetop village. And get in there for a lot. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Let's go treetop village. And attack for eight. Get in there for seven. And he's got one turn to come back. Oh, he started not to block, which is fine. Discards the worm coil. Not a problem.
recurring nightmare. Sacrifices the Prowler, I suppose. Bring back the Worm Coil. And he dies to a treachery. Mm hmm. So, he can probably attack first. Or not. Just go straight to the worm coil. So, yep. Won that one again. Cool. The target non creature, so. I will have to show him my treachery, but that's not a big deal. Alright, so that was game one, and the deck, wow, just was amazing this game. So, let's see if we can keep it up. Alright, so, do I want anything here? Shuffles Graveyard, and draws seven cards. That could be good. I'm actually going to try a time reversal here. The thing is, like, if he starts discarding a lot of things to his graveyard, I can shuffle all that and draw some new cards, refill my hand, keep him off reanimate. Could be interesting. And it's worth giving a shot anyway, so I'm going to submit and see if that actually is a good card. 